We all know QR codes are on menus, social media, billboards, really anywhere. Try going a day without seeing one. They're very useful in getting out information quickly and fast, but police departments are now warning, be careful when you are using those QR codes. This morning, Heather Massey with the Better Business Bureau joins us to tell us what to watch out for. Good morning, Heather. Thanks for joining us. Good morning. Well, QR codes are known as quick response codes. We see them a lot in marketing materials, event promotions, and especially at restaurants. What these do is you scan them with your smartphone. They pop up a link, usually with black lettering, a yellow background, and they redirect you to that site, the event, or even the menu. But what scammers are doing now is they're copying QR codes to redirect you to a site or financial institution they want you to go to and not the actual site that's intended. Unfortunately, QR codes, you can't decipher them with the human eye, so it's important to pay attention and look out for some of those details so you can spot these phony QR codes. Yeah, absolutely. And, and so help us out a little bit. So when we scan the code, they might be taking us to fake websites. Some we can spot, but you're saying some we can't? Yeah, especially if you're looking directly at the QR code, but pay attention to that link when it pops up. See what it says and how it's directing you. And then when you're actually on the website, look for that lockbox at the top and make sure it's legitimate. If you see things on the website like gross misspellings or too good to be true offers, you might take a pause. And specifically, if you've noticed a website or something that has redirected is absolutely faulty, please notify the business. It's important that we get the information to them so they can Remove, remove these phony QR codes. Yeah, Heather, at the BBB, y'all deal with all types of scams. Would you suggest that we just stop using QR codes altogether? What's the best way to get through our world nowadays uh, while being safe? Well, QR codes are great for a variety of reasons, and you want to make sure that when you are using them, they can be extremely safe and, and effective, but check for things that might be tampered with. A great example is parking meters. A lot of the new ones have QR codes to make it easy. You pay your parking meter, but scammers could put stickers over that. So be diligent when you're looking at it and make sure you're paying the correct parking meter so you don't come out with a ticket or your vehicle towed. So just really look at the details and make sure there's not sticker overlays on some of those. Yeah, absolutely. I, we see stickers everywhere here in Austin. And, and last question, really, you know, where are you seeing the most issues? Are there certain areas or, or industries that we should pay more attention to or is it just scammers are just trying to get us anywhere? It's unfortunate it is everywhere. A lot of these come out as you might see event materials that are laying around or outside restaurants. It could be actually anywhere. And you think, oh, this is a great deal. They'll entice you with maybe 50% off an item and you wanna scan it and really get that item quickly. But they can redirect you to phony social media sites that they have you sign up for or those websites that they're looking to gain that personal information and ultimately your financial information. Yeah, absolutely. Some great information there. We appreciate you as always. Heather Massey with the Better Business Bureau. Thanks for joining us this morning. Thank you for having me. We'll be right back on Good Day.